Hey team, here we are at the uh, 2015 MPE show and just wanted to show you some of the new features that's going to be upcoming in the uh, QPR Walk Behind 10 Gallon Melter. Uh, some things that you won't see in the other melters that you'll see in ours. Uh, we've got the custom guard here, removable guard for the gauge. Uh, we find a lot of times this gauge gets broken. We've got a really nice QPR logo on here that's the QPR orange. It'll be matching our top. Just a good feature there. We've got uh, a feature on the handle here. Oftentimes you'll see guys that are working and you've got hot liquid inside. And when you're moving that liquid, a lot of the other units out in the marketplace, uh, this lid will move and fall off. We've just got a simple gravity locking handle. When you're moving that into the truck, it won't come up. Turn it here, it's easily. Nice safety feature for when you're wrapping up at the end of the day. The other features that we've had, you'll see that a lot of the other melters only have one handle on the front. Uh, the new QPR melter has a handle on each side, and that means it's easy to lift in the truck. It's glove friendly, nice and wide, and you can lift it side to side instead of having to go front to back. So much easier to put in your truck at the end of the day. The new melter also inside will have a screen guard that will go up and down inside. Uh, the screen guard, we think, will do a really good job of protecting the plastic packaging from going into the feed point. Uh, this one doesn't show up, but the new ones will have it. Uh, paint on the outside of the melter is going to be 800 degree temperature paint. We think that should have a good life out in the field, so we need all your feedback to make sure and know uh, is the paint working, any issues about that. Uh, the front label here, uh, both uh, competitors and what QPR has had in the past, has just been a simple plastic decal. The new label is going to be a really nice aluminized metal label. should look good and be extra durable over time. The unit is compact. It can be uh, disassembled very quickly. And one of the features that we've innovated in is that down here, all of this can come apart very quickly with just a simple wrench and screw. And so before, the only way you could clean this was to take a torch to it. Now you can just take this off, drop it in a you know, one gallon pail of diesel at night, dissolve everything back, and within four or five minutes the next morning, slide that back in and it'll all be clean and nice without having to heat and bake it. Hey, we're back again at the MPE show and here's a few more features to share with you. One of the other things that you'll see in a lot of the melters is, is that the wand that comes in the side is at a straight angle. And so what happens is, a, you get your hose dragging on the ground, and then B, when you're working to put in the wand, you've got to bend over, you can't have any visibility on where you're trying to put the wand, so you're trying to get in here and put it in this way. Our new melter, the wand goes in at about a 45 degree angle, and the other thing that we found with the older style melters is that as soon as you put in the wand, the wand goes out. So we have improved ventilation in the chimney area. So these ventilation holes now are a little bit larger and we have more of them. That helps the chimney effect and you shouldn't see the torch go out. One of the things we need your feedback on in the field is does that create a wind issue when the melter is operating in high wind environments, do you see the wand blowing out? We don't think it will and our testing shows that, but any feedback you have for us we'll really appreciate it. One of the other innovations we've been working on is an adjustable flow gate spreader. And the concept here is, is that we're going to build a small gate right here and then that'll have a sliding gate up and down so when you have a crack that's extra large what happens with the traditional gate spreader is you can't get enough material in that crack this will allow for a bead action to go on the crack where extra material can be put in the middle of a wide crack and that'll be an accessory feature so when the unit comes out it'll come with a standard uh, square shoe just like the normal but then there will also be a second shoe that will be included with the melter that will be the adjustable gate shoe. Alright well that wraps it up for our review of our improvements in the QPR melter, QPRUSA.com, QPRCanada.com. Remember the melter is only as good as the feedback we get from you so if you see things that we ought to be thinking about, things that we think are good ideas that need improvement, let us know. We're here to serve.